35% of the entire web traffic worldwide is YouTube. Originating from deep inside the Rocky Mountains, transported through the power of the internet, and arriving inside your tiny earbuds, it's the Appraiser Coach Podcast. Minisode. 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 All right, welcome one, welcome all. Dustin Harris hanging out once again on another Minisode. Hey, appreciate you, you being here. Uh, if you are on YouTube, you're going to see a little bit of a different uh, style today. We're going to talk a little bit about that. First, I want to pause and remind you that we are sponsored by a great company. Uh, that great company, of course, is Spark. Sparkforappraisers.com is where you learn more about how you can save time, which means more efficient appraisal reports, better quality, more efficiency. Sparkforappraisers.com. Well, folks, I want to make an announcement uh, today on this mini soda. Super, super excited about some changes coming in uh, in here, the new year, uh, 2023. Um, I say new changes, but they are not uh, completely new to the Appraiser Coach podcast. I'll, I'll explain that in just a little bit. Let me set this up. And, and by the way, stick with me because after the break, I want to share with you what this big change for the podcast has to do with you as an appraiser in your local area. Trust me, you're going to want to stay on board for that. But first, I wanted to make a, an announcement to everybody uh, via this uh, particular episode um, that uh, we are moving back to the video format for YouTube. Now, we've been on YouTube. Every I think every one of our episodes is on YouTube. You can get any, any episode up there. Uh, some people, that's their preference. That's how they like to listen to the Appraiser Coach podcast. Uh, others, of course, are on Libsyn or um, um, uh, you name it, um, you know, uh, iHeartRadio. Um, we are on uh, Apple Podcasts. We are on um, uh, Spotify. You name it. We're, we're all over the place, right? Uh, and we are getting, by the way, more and more traffic as, as, as things roll out. It's amazing to see how this program has grown over the years. Uh, we're, we're now well over 800 episodes and continue to grow. I have no plans to stop anytime soon, folks. So thank you for being there. Thanks for hanging out with me. I'm super Super excited for the way things are going and, and the way things are moving. Um, but uh, we are we are now going to be live, not live. We are now going to be on YouTube. Uh, I'm recording live, but uh, we're going to play it on YouTube uh, for your viewing pleasure. Uh, now, some of you are going to say, oh, Dustin, I've seen your face. Uh, that's not a pleasure at all. I understand. I get it. Th my wife tells me the same thing. But nonetheless, we are moving to a video format and, uh, and, and, and would love to have you along for the ride. Uh, check it out uh, at our, our YouTube channel. Just type in The Appraiser Coach. You'll find us on YouTube. If you're interested in, in, in what it looks like in my studio, um, you know, here, uh, here uh, in my, what I call my broom closet, uh, I'll just give you a, a quick a video tour here, right? Um, so if you're on YouTube, um, I'm just going to take this camera. I'm just going to turn it a little bit here. Um, I better loosen this up just a titch first. Uh, it really is a small office uh, here and, uh, you know, 100 square feet, maybe. Um, turn the camera just a little bit. I've got my background back there. Uh, that's what you normally see. We've got a couple different uh, viewing angles um, on YouTube. And uh, and so if you're interested in kind of seeing what my setup is uh, here at uh, at the quote unquote studio, uh, feel free to to jump on uh, YouTube, look up this uh, episode, and we would love and invite you uh, to be there uh, going forward. Um, why? Wh why, Dustin? Why the change? Why after 800 episodes? Now, first of all, I want to remember this is not necessarily a change. It's a reversion back. Years ago, we did this. Uh, and, and what I would do is turn on my web camera, uh, which was on my laptop, and we would record the video as I did the episode. There was not multiple angles. Uh, it was not a very good camera. There was a long, tedious process uh, to get everything proof, uh, proofed, edited, uh, um, you know, and, and uploaded to YouTube. And so honestly, the views were not high enough to justify the cost of, of continuing to do that. Um, so we stopped. And I think that was a good decision at the time. The world has changed, um, and this is going to lead into what I want to talk about after the break, um, about how this applies to you. But folks, I don't know if you noticed, but video is kind of a big deal. 
uh, out there. And there's a couple things that we're going to be doing that you're going to see coming uh, uh, moving forward. We're going to have more of a presence on social media moving forward. So look for that. Uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook, not TikTok yet. <laughs> we'll see. Um, but uh, but but the question is why? why? Why change? It's a podcast, right? You come here for the information in an audible format. I get that. By the way, do not watch YouTube while you drive around taking your comp photos. There's still the great ability to be able to hear this and be able to multitask and drive at the same time. And I highly recommend and encourage that for safety. But if you happen to be at your desk uh, and you would like to see the how the sausage is made, if you will, uh, not just my voice, but uh, but kind of my setup here. And uh, yeah, I think it's it's a different experience when you can see my facial features. Uh, I like to talk with my hands. You'll see that quite a bit as well. Um, and uh, and again, the, the various uh, uh, um, uh, angles. Uh, by the way, I've ordered a third camera. Uh, believe it or not, that I'm gonna I'm gonna mount right up there. Um, that uh, that will kind of give the you know the the bird's eye view down um, view. So I'm ex I'm excited for that. That should be here next week. Um, but uh, but for now we've got the we've got the side view. We've got the front view. Uh, and uh, it's just it's just a lot of fun. It's just a lot of fun to just do things a little bit different. Again, I keep alluding to the question that I don't answer the answer the damn question, Dustin. Why? Well, folks, video is king. I mean, that really is what it comes down to. It's about marketing. It's about being seen. It's about being found. Um, Google owns YouTube. I don't know if you knew that, but they do. Uh, did you know that YouTube video, just YouTube alone, I'm not talking about general Google, I'm not talking about any other format for video, just YouTube alone makes up 35% of traffic on the internet. Let me repeat that. 35% of the entire web traffic worldwide is YouTube. Okay, If you're not on YouTube, you're dead. <laughs> so, uh, you know, part of this is going to be rudimentary. We're going to be learning as we go, like I said, adding another camera uh, and, and doing some other things. You know, uh, maybe we'll do some special effects. I don't know. We'll, we'll we'll just play with it. We'll work it out. We'll see how that looks like uh, long term. But for now, this is what you get. And I know that some people are interested. You know, it doesn't matter what talk show you listen to. It is more interesting. You get more insight when you watch than when you just listen alone. So we're we're moving. We're moving back to the YouTube format. Now, that does not mean we're going away from Spotify or um, you know any other format, you know, Apple Podcasts or wherever you find your podcasts. Uh, we're still going to be there. Exactly the same as we've been in the past. This just gives you one more option to be able to uh, to to participate here at the Brazer Coach podcast. I want to come back and share with you what this means to you or what it should mean to you and why this is important to every single appraiser who is listening to The Voice right now. Wait for that. But first, I want to pause and remind you about a great company called Spark. Sparkforappraisers.com, folks. That's where you go. Spark for, F-O-R, appraisers.com. That's where you go to find out about efficiencies, about how you can reduce the amount of time that you spend in your appraisal report. Folks, I'm telling you, this is, it is, it will boggle your mind what it can do. I really am not overselling it. You need to get on to sparkforappraisers.com and find out what it can do for you because it can save you tons of time on your appraisal reports. Sparkforappraisers.com. <laughs> Welcome back to the program, everybody. Dustin Harris, another quick mini-sode for you today, just talking a little bit about some changes here at the Appraiser Coach Podcast. We are now back on YouTube. So as you hear my voice, you can now see my lips move. You can see my facial features. You can see me talk with my hands. I don't know why I do that, but I do uh, just to have it uh, from, from, from way back when I was a kid. Uh, I just, I, I'm a very ant animated speaker. So you'll, you'll get to experience that if you're on YouTube. You can find us on our YouTube channel. Um, and, uh, and, and just, again, just go to YouTube, uh, youtube.com, type in The Appraiser Coach. You will find us and you can subscribe. Uh, I'm not going to get into the whole punch that subscribe button and, and ring that bell and, and all the other stuff that my, uh, that my kids make fun of when they watch their YouTube videos. But uh, in all seriousness, if you do subscribe, then you won't miss an episode. Uh, it'll just pop onto your phone and, uh, or your computer and you can, and you can listen and, and not forget that another one has dropped. So I do encourage you to do that. Uh, that would be helpful uh, for, for both of us. So why should you care? 
Well, again, I, I set this out. 35% of the internet's traffic overall is YouTube content. It's a big, big deal. Uh, king, uh, video is king, right? People are looking for video. Um, that's why we're doing it. We want to be able to be found. We sometimes have a lot of topics that any appraiser would be interested in. And I think sometimes it gets lost uh, just because when you Google it, uh, I know that's a verb now, right? Google it. Um, it's not going to come up. But uh, because the podcasts don't show up the same way in search engines as as a, a YouTube video will, uh, and and what we've done in the past with the still frames, you know, again, we've I think every episode of the uh, of the Appraiser Coach podcast can be found on the YouTube channel. Maybe not. Maybe they drop off after a while. Probably need to look into that. Uh, but at least we've put them up, right? We've produced them. We've put them up. But typically, it's just the sound, uh, and it's a still frame. Right, and that just does not get the traction on YouTube that uh, that this does. Right, to to be able to look you in the eye, to be able to say hi, uh, and 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 be able to you know just have a a different interactive, if you will, experience uh, with the podcast. That's going to help us with search in, engine optimization, SEO. It's going to be help help us with social media to be shared. Uh, we're going to be doing some. I know sounds crazy, old guy like me. Going to be doing reels. I'm not going to do any dances. Okay. But uh, we're going to be doing some reels to put out there on Instagram and uh, and and Facebook and some of these other places so that people can find the podcast. Why should you care? Well, every principle that I have just laid out for you concerning why we're doing what we're doing here at the Appraiser Coach Podcast should be taken to heart by you as an appraiser in your local market. Okay, I am serious when I say that if you want to be known and you want to be known as the expert, you need to be on YouTube right? You need to have your own YouTube channel. At the very least, you need to have video on your website. Go to your website right now. Go to your homepage. And I know some of you are like, well, I've just got an all mode website, or I've just got this, or I don't. Folks, go to your homepage. If you don't find video there, and one of the first things that you do, right, there's something amiss, and there's something you need to be doing. People like to interact with video, right? Um, people want to see you. They want to trust you. I talk about this marketing the two rules of marketing over and over and over again. And by the way, if you Google that, the two rules of marketing, you're probably not going to find this. This is the, you know, a, a phrase that I coined, if you will, years ago. Um, and, and maybe it's a thing. Maybe, I, you know, maybe I, I, I got it from somewhere else and didn't even know it. But the idea is to be known, number one, and to be known as the expert, number two. That's the key. Be known, be known as an expert. And in today's world, a lot of it's not face-to-face. But I'm telling you, folks, the, the the best we can do next to face to face is going to be what you're seeing right now on YouTube video, right? Seeing my face, seeing my surroundings, getting to know me on a different level. That's going to be the same principle at, at stake for you as an appraiser in your local market. Make video, get out there in video. I promise you, it will be worth your while. Thank you for joining me. Uh, thank you for for uh, for for switching, if you will. Uh, I would highly encourage that you that you go to the YouTube uh, and 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 tell me what you think. I, I'd love to hear the comments below. One of the things that YouTube is great about is comments, right? And I don't care if they're mean. I don't care if they're rude. I'm not going to erase them. I'm not going to delete them. I'm not going to censor you. Tell me how you feel. I mean, that's what that's. What I would love to. I mean, be nice, but tell me, give me feedback. What can you see that we could do differently? What do you wish? What where did I get it wrong? right? I love the interaction. It's been hard with podcasts because you listen in the car. You don't really think about commenting when you get back to the office and you're in front of the computer, but YouTube's different. So I'm hoping to get some feedback from you. Uh, thank you again. Punch that subscribe button, right? Uh, would, uh, would love any feedback that you have. Thank you again for being a loyal listener and now a loyal viewer. And uh, we will catch you next time. You've been listening to the Appraiser Coach podcast with Dustin Harris. If you like what you hear, please give us a five-star rating and post a short review on iTunes. For more in-depth insider information on how you can make more money as a real estate appraiser, visit theappraisercoach.com and sign up for the All-Star team today. Thanks for joining us. And now, get out there and create some value.